Welcome to an introduction to the cloud service video. Step 1, creation of a cloud account. The Dataprobe iBoot G2 and iBoot PDU series of remote power control devices can connect with our cloud server, allowing you to control power without having to do any extra setup to your local network. Compatible devices communicate with our cloud. Then you log on to your cloud account on our server and control power. My name is Sam and this video will demonstrate how to create your own cloud account. The first thing to do is open a browser and navigate to iBoot.co. Notice this is not a .com but a .co address. In the upper right corner click on register to open the registration form. Enter a username that does not exist for any current user. A green check mark will confirm that it is available and a red circle with an X indicates you need to try another name. Enter an email that does not exist for any current user. Once again, a green check mark will confirm it is available, and a red circle with an X indicates that the email address is already in use for another account. Enter a password that is at least six characters long. Confirm the password by entering the same password again. Click the Sign Up button to submit the form. A page will be displayed to let you know we are almost done. The system will send you an email. The email will come from ibcs at dataprobe.com and contain a link for you to confirm the account and the email address. This is what the email will look like. Click the link to confirm the email address and the website will show you a welcome screen. This screen confirms the account has been created and is active. If you wish to log on to the account now, you can click the Log Me In button and log in for the first time. Now that you have established your account, you can assign iBoot G2 series devices as demonstrated in the Step 2 video and or Assign iBoot PDU class devices as demonstrated in the Step 3 video. Cloud features and control options are demonstrated in the introduction video Step 4. Thank you for your interest in the Dataprobe Cloud Service.